हाई एंड हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू यूट्यूब चैनल मैथ क्लासेज बाय संदीप नाउ इन टूडेज वीडियो वी विल डू हेयर क्वेश्चन नंबर टू ऑफ एक्सरसाइज टेन पॉइंट टू नाउ क्वेश्चन नंबर टू प्रूव दैट इफ कॉर्स ऑफ कॉन्वेंट सर्कल सब टेंट इक्वल एंगल्स एट देर सेंटर्स देन द कॉर्स आर इक्वल एज वी डेट इन लास्ट वीडियो क्वेश्चन नंबर फर्स्ट इन देयर रिवर्स ऑफ दिस that cos subtend equal angle at the center but now in this reverse of that equal angles subtended by cos are equal so now again here we are assuming two convex circles c1 and c2 now again same this is center o and this is triangle oab and the second P center and this P Q or this is a triangle. Now these two triangles are convex because radius of these two triangles is same. In triangle OAB and triangle P Q R. Now OA equal to P Q. OA equal to PQ because radius is same. OA equal to PQ and then OB equal to PR. OB equal to PR because radius is equal. Now, after that, here in this question, given that angle subtended at center. that are equal it mean angle aob equal to angle qpr these two angles are equal as it is given now again three conditions are here we satisfy that these two triangles are convex two sides and one angle therefore these two triangle oab oab is convex to triangle pqr is convex by sas side angle side it mean two side included angle so these two triangles are convex after convex condition we can say each and every part of these two triangles are equal so here ab and qr is also equal therefore ab equal to qr this is by cp CT corresponding part of convex triangle. It means AB and QR. These are two cords of these circles, convex circle. So again, we have proved that convex circles subtend equal angles at their centers. Then the cords are equal. So we have proved again this in your question number second. Reverse of that, vice versa. That was in question number one. Thank you for watching this